In this clip, we are glassing down the forward casting deck of our Aquasport project boat. 30 minutes prior to putting down the glass tape, we made a fillet of wood flour and epoxy. The fillet is not yet cured, so the biaxial tape will be applied wet on wet. We'll talk more about the wet on wet method later. Using a 2 inch chip brush, begin wetting out the fiberglass tape. The tape will not go completely clear right away. Just keep working your way down the seam as the epoxy soaks into the fiberglass. It's helpful to begin by wetting out a length of tape about 24 inches long. Start on the top side of the tape. This way any excess will drip down and help wet out the lower portion. For this job we're going to be using 6 inch 12 ounce biaxial fiberglass tape and marine epoxy resin. When we say to work wet on wet, we mean to wet out your fiberglass before the fillet underneath it is cured, so that the fillet and the glass tape cure together. A wet on wet joint or lamination is stronger because the epoxy and the fillet cure together and form what we call a primary bond or a chemical bond. Working wet on wet also makes for a much cleaner joint. The alternative to wet on wet is to make a fillet, let it cure, come back and sand the fillet smooth, then lay down the tape. This process takes more time, produces a weaker joint, and wastes epoxy. Please see our other shop clips for more information on mixing epoxy and making a fillet. When wetting out 6 inch 12 ounce biaxial tape, a handy rule of thumb is that it will take approximately one liquid ounce of mixed epoxy to wet out one linear foot of tape. When working wet on wet, the fillet will still be soft under the tape, so be careful not to deform the fillet by putting too much pressure on the brush. Work out any air bubbles by lightly tapping with a 2 inch chip brush. Add more epoxy only if necessary. Pooling of the epoxy is an indication that you're using too much. You only want to use enough epoxy to wet out the glass. Any more is just waste. In fact, your laminate will be weaker if you use too much epoxy. <laughs> 